Hello everyone, this is Moop, and this is our Server Spotlight series. Today, we're going to look at the Consortium Server. So, let's go ahead and get started. What we have in front of us is, uh, well, the player-made uh, village of Consortium, which I think is aptly named. But we're going to go ahead and fly around the map in this little area to sh showcase kind of what the players of this community have created. Um, the description of the server, the consortium server, is an Agos client mob supporter. It boasts 20,000 creatures, a 3 time skill, and 4.5 time action speed increase. There are two maps. There's a PvE and a PvP map. Both maps have all four kingdoms um, represented. And the PvE map has Hunt of the Ancients, or Hoda, if you would like to participate in and um, enjoy some light competition for moon medals and statues. However, the PvP server offers higher moon medal veins as well as a mod where you users can randomly get moon medals, uh, moon ore, when mining, much like uh, you would get with gems. The server has enabled several mods including bounties for killing creatures, so you can make silver by hunting. There's no priest restrictions. There's You can dig like mining. And there's a harvest mod, which I uh, I expect that means there you the um, crops never go into decay or never have weeds. This is kind of cool out here. I like what they did here. This is a little little farm, beautiful terrain. This is a custom map that was made by the server game masters or the GMs. Um, Let's see, there's only, a, when, when you're talking about deed, there's only a cost to the creation of the deed. There is no upkeep costs. Um, meditation is really nice because it's guaranteed to ask a question on uh, if you're available for a question. And then uh, the, the question timer is only one-fourth of what it is in Worm Online. So usually it's something like 24 days, so it's only one-fourth of that. This is a nice little, a little homestead. There's someone sawing and making, making something. Oh, there they are. That gentleman or lady, but we don't have ladies in Worm yet. Beautiful terrain. It's a new player friendly. Um, for you new players out there and you're looking for a server to start on, you can uh, rest assured that each starting town has your basic necessities, uh, including a merchant, a guide, a clay, a clay pit, iron veins, and a bartender to help you with your nutrition and your water. Um, again, you can make silver or coinage by going out and hunting, which is really rewarding, or by creating items and selling them to the merchant. The server GMs, I've spoke with them, uh, very nice, very nice people dedicated to their server, dedicated to the game. The community assistants or CAs seem uh, just as appropriate and willing to help new players. This is a nice little little area. I like how they put the, the crops on the upper upper portion of their little deed. This looks nice. This is like a little temple area, huh? It's like uh, you're right into phase Dothrock. You can pray your little prayer there. Beautiful, beautiful scenery. Oh, it's another another person here making, we're in Jen Kellen uh, Kingdom, making a nice road here. This is a lot of time spent in here, man. Beautiful. Just doing a, a little flyabout. I would say walkabout, but we're not really walking now, are we? That's a joke. John Locke from Lost. A little walkabout in Australia. And there's much more to the server that um, we can highlight. For the, for the sake of time, I just wanted to whet your appetite and let you know that this seems to be a great server. If you're new or if you're a veteran, you're starting out, and you want to partake in uh, you know, just kind of this gentle gentle part of the game or 
if you want to actually become hardcore in PvP, you can probably head over to the PvP server on the East Coast and try for Kingdom titles and, you know, become an Emperor or the Chancellor or the High Grand Prince and, uh, you know, and, and enjoy all those different benefits that maybe you weren't able to in Worm Online, either on the Epic Cluster or the Chaos uh, server. Um, so I, I hope you enjoyed this brief server spotlight, the Consortium server. You'll find it on the server list when you open your Worm Online client. But go ahead and check them out. And, uh, you know, feel free to send a support ticket in if you have questions or ask in the chat if you have questions or you're new. And I'm sure the GMs and the CAs are more than willing to, to help you out. Um, if you have questions about the server, you can probably go ahead and place a comment and uh, I'll try to write them or I'll try to direct your questions to the server admins. And if you have any servers that you want spotlighted, go ahead and write a comment below or send me an email or a private comment on my YouTube channel. Until then, thanks for watching. I hope you have a great night.